Hello and welcome back here to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit. We are in one of the 2.5 cars, but we're testing something different, which brings the question I bring up to you guys here today. Do you think the 2.5 should get a power boost? Do you think we should increase the power a little bit from the street cars we have now? This car is currently at about 451, 452 horsepower. So do you think the 2.5 should get a boost in power before they get released? Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section down below. We are at a track that is kind of local to me, being from Ohio, Kill Care. So we're gonna go test the new flow layout that they have here in a set of Corsa and uh, have a little fun with this 13. So if you guys have been on the actual like tandem comp track you would be hooking it in around here but this is actually a flow track so it's great for tandems and things of that nature which is what we are going to be probably switching onto the server so we're going to kick it this way i definitely love the bump up onto the bank and the cutting in on the track it's definitely a fun track first time actually out here on this layout in this 451 horsepower s13 v2.5 physics oh yeah i like this track it's small but it's kind of flowy i like going up onto the bank that's definitely a lot of fun so like i said in the beginning do you guys think we should do a power bump on the 2.5s before I release them. Do you think I should up them up to about 450 horsepower, make them a little bit more powerful than the street cars, but a little less powerful than the original street cars that I brought out a long time ago with the A90 Super that was about 570. So 450 horsepower I feel is a pretty achievable horsepower when it comes to a real world drift car, especially with turbos and everything of that nature or V8s. So I think I, I want to bump the power up, but I want to get everybody's kind of opinion on it before I actually go ahead and change all the two fives over to a new power band. That bump is definitely crazy. This, uh, this track is a lot of fun. I'm having a blast on this track. And I think the server is going to be going to this track and uh, we're going to be doing a little bit of local drifting because, like I said, I am from Ohio, so... This is kind of, I guess you would say, a local style track to me. And it's definitely be fun to get some tandems on a track that uh, you could actually go and drift if you were from, you know, in Ohio or around it and things of that nature. We're going to flip it around. I know that'd be running the track backwards, but we're going to see how this goes in the other direction. So I think I definitely like the cars having a little bit more power. It allows them to do a little bit bigger courses and things of that nature with, you know, the Evil Rabbit Drift Playground and everything almost near completion. The cars with a little bit more power would definitely be more suitable for the tracks and the bigger layouts and you can run the short layouts as well as the big layouts. So it's something I've been dabbling with in my head on upping the power and I am just having a blast with this car. Actually, is this actually the way you're supposed to go? I mean, it might be. We may have went on the track in the wrong direction because if you came, that could be the offshoot and this could be the entrance. So if you guys know the actual way to run this track, because I am not entirely sure, let me know down in the comments. Oh, that might be it. Kick it in. Yep, this way flows so much nicer. I think I do like this way flowing a little bit better, but if you guys know the way the track actually flows, let me know down in the comments, all my Ohio, PA, New York drifters that may be around on this track, let me know down in the comments because I have never actually been to this track in real life. So, definitely need to get there though. So. I'm having a lot of fun with this higher power and it's definitely handles very well and I think we may be switching the streetcars to a higher power for the 2.5 release. Still a few little tweaks I need to do to the cars such as adjusting colliders and things of that nature to make the colliders a little bit better. There's a little bit of a wall tap though. 
to make the colliders a little bit better and nicer for the cars to make tandeming that much easier. Oh. Switch it up into first person. Well, oh, I cut that really short. Back on the bank, there we go. A little left foot braking. That evil rabbit energy wheel going round and round. Oh, that's gonna be a grass cut. That was a bad, uh, that was a bad transition there. Definitely enjoying doing a bunch of different tracks, and this track is actually so much fun that I would like to get some tandems with some friends and some of you guys as well on this track. So we are in the final. Oh, don't try switching views when you're drifting. In the final testing stages of the 2.5s so it's definitely very close to bringing them out to you guys doing final testing on the evil rabbit playground with hexer to make sure all of that is set because that is also almost done and ready to go just want to make sure there's no bugs and if we need to make any little tweaks and things of that nature we need to want to catch it before we uh drop it because we don't want to drop it and then have all these bugs and everything and you know got to make it as close to perfect as we can even though nothing will ever be perfect because we all know sometimes you can't catch everything and that's what the community will find for you whether it's constructive criticism or bashing you in the comments about your cars it's definitely something that will be found so make sure you guys follow me on all social media all of which are found in the description box below just a quick little video and talk for you guys here today on friday the end of the week so that we can kind of get some uh, answers from you guys. If you guys think I should up the power a little bit to what this car is right now, which is about 453, 451, 452. I don't know the exact number, but it's a, it's over 450 and under 455. So I hope you guys will let me know down in the comments what you guys think. So as always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. That was way off course. I was looking at the other screen. I'll see you guys on the track. <laughs>